There's so many types of glitch. This is a selective glitch tutorial that I'm showing you. We're basically gonna add like a like a glitch overlay or a glitch video. And a mask on top of that to enhance the the glitches effect. So let's get into it. Step one: add a draw mask to the clip you want the glitch on. Step two: draw around the character you want to have the effect on. So here we've got a model that we're just going to draw around in a bathing suit with the keyframe. It doesn't have to be perfect. It just has to sort of cover the object you want to glow and, you know, have that sort of glitchy vibe. Step three, go to the beginning frame by pressing up. So first off, you just want to invert the mask and then take the opacity to around 30 and then toggle the keyframe buttons on position, scale and control points. Step four, from the beginning of the clip, move the mask to mimic the body across the clip. So basically just tracking your mask across that clip. So step five, once you're done with tracking, add the glitch video to your editing line. So find an appropriate glitch video, one full of colors. Step six, add the mask video to lay on top of the original. Step seven, drag the glitch video between both masked clips. There you go. You should. So you want to drag it right in between there and clip anything that you don't need making sure that you're selecting the best bit of that glitch video. Step eight, duplicate the mask and add the bad TV effect on top of that clip. So just option drag that mask above, align it, and then search for the bad TV effect and then drag that on top of the top mask clip. And then change the parameters of the bad TV to anything that looks visually appealing to you. So I drag the amount of bad TV all the way up and a little bit of roll. And to enhance this clip, to make it glow or to make it sort of shine or make it dreamy, I do have another effect called the glow effect that you guys can download below. The first 100 people to download that effect, get it for free. So make sure you're quick to download it. Step nine. So what you wanna do is click onto the glitch video, press the up button to go directly to the first frame and select the keyframe on opacity on composition. So opacity is at zero and then we wanna play ahead until you hear that beat drop or just before the beat drop. You then drag the opacity up a little bit and then jump two frames ahead where you then put the opacity to 100. So here is the side by side of what it looks like before and after. Hope you like that one guys. Um, if you can support me, I have a separated glitch that's out right now when we're promoting it. For those of you who've bought it already, it's helping massively in supporting this channel and continuing to give you guys content. And above all, it's also helping you guys in terms of, you know, making your videos it's a really cool effect i haven't seen it really anywhere else before so you know have a look at that separate glitch 